so what should we pick today? Let's do this one. Ooh, Sunday coffee. Let's try it. Good morning, Yarna Bees, or good day, good hello, good evening, <laughs> whatever it may be for you. I just woke up. Ow! Hello! The dog's trying to beat me up with her toy. She decided to wake me up. She's like, Mom, get up. You got to do a video. Yeah. And uh, last night, I was up until 2.30 in the morning. I... Just I missed, I stupidly went on Facebook and decided, hey, I haven't played Candy Crush in a long time. I think I'm going to play a game, right? <sighs> Two hours of my life, gone. <laughs> and it's like, I can, I, my eyeballs are hanging out of my head. And I'm like, I can do one more round. I could just get one more round. Yes, I can do it. I can, I can level up. You know, it's like, oh my God. <laughs> yeah. So I kind of slept in this morning and then little miss here decided that she was not going to let me sleep anymore. So <laughs> go away. You've already got me up. Oh, okay. So today is another day of 25 days of Blissmas that I am doing with Rosalie at Yarn It Out. Uh, yeah, so I got my coffee, my Sunday, Sunday coffee. Let's see what it tastes like. It's not horrible. You can tell it's got flavoring. You're just not sure what flavoring it's supposed to be. Yeah, not sure. Not sure, but it's not bad. Yeah, it's okay. It's got a candy kind of flavor to it. Hmm. Yeah. Back up. So the flavors don't seem to be really distinct, right? Um, but you can tell that there is a flavoring in them. Yeah. But it's not, not terrible. It's okay. I can handle it. Anything this morning I can handle because I need coffee. Okay, what are we doing? Oh, our gift. <laughs> okay, gift number two. And, oh no, I don't have my glasses with me. She says, number two, big balls. Okay. Oh God, I can't can't read that first thing in the morning. Uh, sorry, they are messy. They were in clearance, uh, but they, uh, yeah, I can't read it. Anyways, <laughs> okay, let's open it. Mm. 
<laughs> oh, you can't be serious. <laughs> wow. You, oh, you guys. Oh, do I have a story for you? Okay. She got me three skeins of Yarnspiration Burnett Toasty. Isn't that pretty? Uh, you know what? I need my glasses for this. Hold on. Okay. That's better. Okay. <laughs> so, this is hilarious. Oh my God. Okay. So this is called, well, mauve. It's called mauve. And it's a bulky five. It's 93% acrylic, 7% nylon. And it's a boucle. Kind of yarn. <laughs> and she got me three. <laughs> Thank you, Rosalie. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. That's, that's great. I had just purchased a pattern. And uh, <clears throat> I'll, I'll leave the link for the pattern down below. And this pattern it's a a sweater kind of a pullover sweater with a hoodie and um i've never made anything like it before so i was really excited to try it but it's made with boucle yarn right and boucle for those of you that don't know what boucle is boucle yarn is this wavy wavy kind of yarn right? It's kind of like homespun boucle, right? And I was like, oh, I got to find a boucle yarn, right? Last night, before I started on the Candy Crush thing, I spent, I don't know how long on going on all the different yarn sites to find a boucle yarn. And this a lot of them were like $10, $12 a, a skein. And I was like, no, nah. I went on, you know, your inspiration where the pattern is. And no, you know, and I, the, the boucle yarn was sold out. And so I did something that I have not done in a couple of years. I went on ice yarns. Now, I loved some of the ice yarns. I did find a boucle yarn. I bought a crap ton of it. The shipping alone was $71. I'm also going to get hit with the border fee which is probably going to be about $40. Um, and that's for like $60. Well, Canadian is probably $80 worth of yarn. I just did that last night. <laughs> this came a day late. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> wow. And this probably would have been enough to do it. Oh, should have waited. <laughs> so, yeah, my bad. Crap. I, uh, yeah. Oh. I even looked on Michael's. I looked, you know, like everywhere I looked. And, uh, and I, I settled with ice yarns. It costs so much money to get ice yarns into Canada. It's ridiculous. You know, it's, it costs way more in 
in border fees and taxes or in shipping um, than the yarn is worth. So, yeah. Um, oh, that picks me just... <laughs> so, yeah, so, uh, well, now I can make two, I guess. This That's awesome. Thank you. Um, it says it's five bulky, but it's, that doesn't look like five bulky to me. But that's okay. That is awesome. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> ah, oh, well. Thank you so much, Rosalie. <laughs> oh, wow. Unbelievable. Okay. So now we are going to do our question or our, our trivia of the day. Last night or yesterday, I asked you, the movie Miracle on 34th Street is based on a real life department store. What is it? You all got it right. <laughs> it was Macy's. <laughs> now, some of you gave me actually trivia back and was telling me that Macy's was not the only store. There was a competitor store. Um, but yeah, Macy's was the store. Yay! Good for you guys. Okay, question number two. What are the two other most popular names for Santa Claus? Leave your comment down below. <laughs> and you can't say Santa Claus. <laughs> ah, okay guys I'm getting beat up by the dog I gotta go beat myself up over my ice yarns order <laughs> I'm gonna drink my funky coffee I try to get my brain to engage <laughs> okay she wants me to play with her all right guys so thanks for joining me and don't forget to go over to Rosalie's to see what I got her. Uh, and uh, I guess I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Tomorrow. I love you. Oh, oh. demonetizing. Okay. <laughs> talk to you. And you don't want to hear me sing. Oh, and I got a message. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs> God, I can't believe this. <laughs> oh, I can cry.